Hey guys, how's it going? Ref Nogal here, Toronto photographer. I had a chance to get my hands on the new Profoto Connect Pro and I just wanted to show you guys just a size comparison. And again, this is just off the cuff, unscripted, so I'm just doing a one take here just to get you some information. So the new remote, very excited about this because we can now finally see the power of the flash uh, as we are making adjustments. Um, not only that, 100 channels here, 100 channels, which is awesome, compared to eight in this guy uh, and uh, 20 channels in the Connect. So really, really cool welcomed addition. Very sleek design as well, as you can kind of see how it's uh, nice clean lines, really beautiful um, LED uh, interface here. I'll just show you the back of it and the, the top. So really well, well designed, very, very sleek. This is the single pin version in case you're wondering what kind of pin that is. Uh, so there is a non-TTL version, which is awesome. So this will work across all cameras. Now you will not get TTL and you'll also not get high speed sync, but native camera sync at, with any camera will sync uh, now due to the single pin uh, option. So that's pretty, pretty cool. I'm gonna turn this on real quick for you guys. Now this is the LED, there's three sets of brightness. So if you're outside on a bright sunny day, so that's really good for me as a wedding photographer because sometimes I'm working in uh, just direct sun and uh, I need to see what I'm doing. So this will be great, uh, great option to have. Um, again, now we can see the channels. Well, you, I don't have anything connected at the moment, but you're going to be able to see the power of the light. Uh, this now has 100 channels. It has Bluetooth capability as well. So very easy firmware upgrades. This is the on and off button here. So you press and hold and it goes, uh, goes off. I'm gonna keep this on real quick so you can see when we compare it to the Air TTL remote. Um, let me see if I can get that. Yeah, there we go. So you guys can kind of see uh, in terms of what that looks like, what that interface looks like. Obviously with the Connect, we don't have an interface, uh, whether you know or don't know. The, Air, the Connect remote is a very simple remote, no buttons on it. Uh, you simply go to manual or auto and um, you can make adjustments in, in the app. So let me quickly show you just um, the size comparison between these two. Just kind of see how it's, it is a little bit longer than the um, Air TTL remote. Just by, a, just by a little bit. In terms of thickness, it is a little bit thinner than the uh, Air TTL remote. And uh, otherwise, it's, they're, they're quite comparable. Uh, again, the new one, Profoto uh, Connect Pro, is a little bit longer. Um, battery compartment, access through the back. Um, here we have two batteries. And uh, the new one, we do have three batteries. And so one other thing that's really interesting here that I want to show you as I take this out. Um, so there's three triple A's, which is, which is good. I think the additional battery, maybe for the fact that we have Bluetooth running and connecting and so on. But what's really interesting too is uh, I found that when you take some of these out, there are these little pins back here. So I don't know whether that means there's going to be another battery option, uh, a battery pack maybe sold uh, separately. Again, I'm just making speculations at this point. I don't know that information. It's just interesting that there is uh, three compartments and one has this kind of uh, battery or this kind of, uh, um, I guess, pins and things to, to connect to. So perhaps something uh, in the future. But anyways, um, this is just a quick size comparison for you guys. If you have any questions about the remote, uh, please leave your comments down below uh, or reach out to me on social media and I will try to get, uh, get back to you with uh, any of the answers uh, that I may know. So uh, one other thing I wanted to show you is actually the um, packaging or the box that this comes in. So this is really nice because this is extremely, I can't crush this with my hand. Ugh. So it's, it's extremely tough. Uh, so the remote is going to sit literally right in here, which is gonna be awesome and well protected. So now if this goes in your camera bag, um, you're pretty good here. So that's a really, really nice uh, addition. Um, and especially when you compare it to what we are used to perhaps with the Air TTL remote, it was just a bag, a Profoto bag, uh, which was nice, but again, there's no, no protection here or anything. So um, that's a nice, uh, nice addition. And obviously the 
Um, Connect just had a silicone um, rubberized cap here where you would place that in here and, uh, and keep your remote in. So this is, um, this is really nice, really well done, really well made. So I think this is gonna be a really great addition um, or this will actually take over as the main remote, I think, for Profoto moving forward. It'll certainly be my main remote uh, as soon as I get my Sony version uh, in hand. So anyways, guys, hopefully um, that helps a little bit. Any questions, please reach out. And again, this is just off the cuff, unscripted. So I'm just doing a one take here just to get you some information. So hope you enjoyed it. Uh, stay tuned, subscribe to more videos, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks a lot.